Hey everybody, welcome to another edition of Uplifting Interviews with Total Strangers. Are we total strangers? Yes, of course. And I don't even know your name. <laughs> John. John. Yeah. <laughs> John is a total stranger and uh, he is flew all the way from Mexico to go shopping in Century City. I thought things were cheaper in Mexico. He says, no, 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 you gotta go to America for the, the good stuff. Yeah, of course. You don't, you don't have the prices you have at the outlets in Mexico. <laughs> Yeah, we have lots of outlets here. Yeah, yeah, but this isn't an outlet store where you're going. No, no, no. no we no, went no. yesterday. Oh, you went to the outlet store. Yeah. Which one? Uh, it was uh, Camarillo. Camarillo. Yeah. Oh, you went all the way out there. Yeah. You know, there's ones closer <laughs> than that, right? Which one? It was. Oh, um, there's one in Los Angeles. What's the name? Um, I don't know the name of it. Um, but there's you know there's there's one in Palm Springs, of course that's further. But uh, so you came, flew to Mexico. You have a big long shopping list. What, what's on your list today? No, what, what do you like? <laughs> what whatever what you we like? Whatever you see. <laughs> Mostly clothes. Yeah, of course. It's because in Mexico you have to you you when when you buy something from the U.S. you have to pay the import duties. Right. So it's way more expensive. So you have to pay. Yeah. Import. When you buy in, uh, on the internet or something. Oh, oh on the internet. Yeah. Oh, so you're just gonna be, you brought some empty suit suitcases. Yeah. Or you're gonna buy some suitcases too. <laughs> no, we brought them. <laughs> <laughs> feel all the good. I used to drive limo. Actually, sometimes I still drive limo. And I remember that I had this rich guy he came in with his private jet and uh he, he, they go shopping here you know yeah. the, the, the guys from dubai i mean yeah, we, all we flew world, commercial right <laughs> yeah they, they, no, they come in their private jet and then they buy and they shop and they shop and they shop and then they take all the limos to bring the and they literally stuff the jet and sometimes they can't fit it all in the jet so the limos got to take some stuff back to the, to to the, the stores no, not to the storage, to where they stay. Yeah, and and take another flight. <laughs> I mean, that's wealth, right? Uh, yeah, where you're stacking a jet full of presents. No, that's not the that's type Christmas of shopping we're doing. That's that, that, that's Christmas shopping at the at the uh, the top level. But no, I love spending money. I don't know what it is, um, but I always spend money I don't have. It's too. harder to get it's than <laughs> than to spend it, right? Oh, it's a lot harder to get than to spend. Are you kidding me? And that's why they have this great thing that's a little plastic card you put in your pocket. And it's like, you just give it to people and they give you things. It's like amazing. But then, the next month? I don't know about that. Somebody else pays my bills. <laughs> I just like giving that plastic card and getting things. And I love the market. I don't know, I'm just a foodie, you know? To me, the market is like Disneyland. I walk into the food market. Yeah. And it's, it's, it's every wall has got food. There's food everywhere. Every kind of food. We're Mexican saying- food. Italian food. French food, <laughs> food everywhere. It's like uh, it's a potpourri of food. Yeah, but here the here the Mexican food is we, we in Mexico call it Tex-Mex. Tex-Mex. Because it, it's like uh, you always use like no, uh, a American I, cheese or yellow cheese. Right, or, yeah, right. You know the Mexican food, and we never use uh, that. Well, cheese. I love the little stands on the ro- side of the road. Yeah, where it's real Mexican. Yeah, the tacos. It might be cat, it might be dog. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's delicious. Though. <laughs> I love Don't worry, it. in Mexico there are dogs and cats. I as well. eat on in Mexico. I eat off those little stands too. Some Mexicans don't even eat off those stands. I eat it because that's real Mexican food, man. Yeah. And the spicy. My my foster mom was Mexican, so really? I, have, I have a little Mexican blood in me. Great. Um, but uh, no, it's um, food is, you know. It's better than sex. It really is. <laughs> no, I'd rather have sex. Than rather sex. Yeah. Well, you can't live without food. You can live without sex. <laughs> no, I don't want to try. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Well, well, you're too young. By the way, are you single? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I'm not married. I have a girlfriend, but I'm Okay. I'm well, if married. you're looking for the next girlfriend after this yeah. one, when a girl walks up to you and she says, how are you? Yeah. You look deep into her eyes and say, I am fan-fucking-tastic. <laughs> it's the best first line you could ever do on a person. Like a, pick you know, up, like a pickup line? Oh, it's, it's, well, first off, making women laugh is, just, is a secret, correct? Yeah, you know of that. Course, yeah. Um, being good looking doesn't hurt. Doesn't hurt. Yeah. <laughs> but making them laugh, you know, you can be ugly it's and still best. get girls, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so when you say you're fan fucking tastic for the first time to someone, it's the best first impression you can make. Because, you know, there's a saying you can't make a first impression a second time. Yeah. And being fantastic is the ultimate positive way to live life. I'm on a mission. You're nine. You just joined, right? Nine forty-five. Yeah. Right. Oh, you get a little sticker, by the way. This is your lucky day. <laughs> Everybody, this is the logo. Be fantastic. Everybody, be fantastic. And that means uh, the B stands for pollinating positivity, thinking positive, knowing today's going to be a great day, knowing you know everything's going to work out, knowing you're going to spend a bunch of money. Put put that in the back of your phone. 
that, that means you're now a member in good standing of the international movement to make the world a better place. 945, ladies and gentlemen. I'm only 900,000. <laughs> oh, 60. No, 999. What is uh, 945 minus a million? What's the number? Okay, that's how many short I am. I believe it's 999,055. <laughs> Right? Yeah, 999,055. What's the number? What does it say? Yeah, 999055. I'm almost there. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah. I'm almost at a million. How long? Thanks uh, to how John. Long did you start it? What kind of name is John anyway? They can't be Mexican. No, my dad's Danish. Huh? My dad's from Denmark. Oh, your dad's from Denmark? Yeah. So you're not Mexican? Yeah, my mom's Mexican. Where, where, is that your mom back there? Yeah. No way. <laughs> She's too young. Are you kidding me? Wow. That was your sister. <laughs> no. She hopes <laughs> she is, but no. Is that your dad? No. <laughs> it's my he's younger young, brother. He's young too. Yeah. He's my younger brother. Well, good for you. You got a beautiful. See, that's why you come out beautiful. See, I always said there should be a judge when two ugly people want to mate. Yeah. The judges say, I'm sorry, no, let's not do this. <laughs> <laughs> Two beautiful people want to meet? Yes, I think we should get, we got a shot here. But have you noticed there's a lot of ugly people that, that have like uh, good looking children? No, I never yeah. noticed that. Yeah. Really? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. You, you know, I think I've seen a lot of girls, girls that are really pretty and the parents are like, oh, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. I, that's, that's a miracle. <laughs> that's fantastic. <laughs> So here we're in Beverly Hills. We're right? in Beverly Hills. Yeah. That's my city. I was born here. That's the police Great. department right there. Um, we're, well, actually, what we'll do is we'll drive down Rodeo Drive. Okay, great. Which is like the it's like the Champs Elysees. Yeah, I've been of there. Paris. It's great. Champs Elysees. I actually walked across the, 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 um, where they have the um, Circle Drive. Yeah. And everyone goes underneath. I was taught by a Frenchman. He says, "What you want to do, because you know they're all there's no lanes, right? They're just going crazy. What you want to do is you want to walk." at a steady pace across the street yeah. and the cars are going this way and they because they're going to miss you you know they're, they're maneuvering as long as you keep the, the same pace yeah they're going to miss you but it's it's nerve-wracking because they're going very fast yeah <coughs> hey, oh you, stupid oh 17 you're not from there you you don't know well first of all no one does that yeah. no one in the right mind the frenchmen <laughs> don't do it and uh, certainly tourists don't do it because they're going to catch eyes you can't catch eyes with the driver either yeah if you catch eyes that he knows you're going to you're going to stop <laughs> yeah. so the trick is to walk very slowly and at a steady pace and they're going to wish in front of you wish in front of you wish behind you and miss you because they don't want to hit you um and i made it it was like it was like i love challenges you know in life. yeah um so this is ladies and gentlemen this is rodeo drive one of the most expensive uh, uh, half mile of uh, shops you could have find on the planet, and they do have specials. You know, hey, Emmaus, they're a Wang. You know, um, Cartier Chanel, um, MG, M MCM. Oh, it looks like they're copying MGM on that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's like a leather. Bulgari, David Yerman, Car there's Cartier. And you have Barney's over there, right? Barney's and... <laughs> and there's McDonald's. No. <laughs> Rolex. Uh, you have a Rolex. You have a Rolex, right? No, man. I have oh, a Casio. <laughs> 40 bucks. There's the Lux. I have a great story. I can't, I can't tell you on camera for the Lux. <laughs> My wife watches this. In Mexico, if you have one of those, probably you get mugged. Yeah. It's like waving <laughs> $20,000 out the window. Yeah. Here you go. Saint, uh, Yves Saint Laurent bought my, bought my wife a purse there for Christmas. Dolce Gabbana, Harry Winston, Van Cleef and Arpel, Louis, Louis Vuitton. Vuitton. I mean, a couple of stores. You could spend a, a, a million dollars pretty quickly <laughs> in, in, in an afternoon on the street. <laughs> First Did you guys ever watch um, Pretty Woman, the movie Pretty yeah, Woman? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the hotel right there, the Beverly Wilshire. Yeah. Pretty Woman. Walking down the street, pretty woman, kind of like to me. So how long are you here for? Uh, we arrived on Wednesday and we leave the next Wednesday. One week. A week? Just one week, yeah. Okay. Now who spends more, you or your mom? Mom. Her. Yeah, of course. Because <laughs> dad's she, not here? No, she gets more money than us. Is that, is <laughs> yeah, because she's 
No, 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 no. no. You left that at home? Yeah. Oh, someone's <laughs> got to work to pay the bills. You right? know, he doesn't like shopping, so he, he said, I ah, you like go. Lo que no sabe es que esta entrevista le va a costar y que con esa lana nos vamos a ir de compra porque es She's saying she's going to charge him for the interview. <laughs> so that we're spending <laughs> that money. <laughs> we're spending that money today. <laughs> Very good. Oh, you Mexicans, always have to make a buck. <laughs> Zero nature, man. <laughs> I tell you, you know, the Be Fantastic movement is very important to me because we need more kind people in the world. Yeah. When you live in a big city, I don't know if you're in the big city where you live, but in the big city, it breeds, because it's a rat race, selfish, greedy, litigious people. Yeah. Right? And the, the world needs more kind people. Let, let someone in in traffic. Open a door for someone. Be Donate. Volunteer. Be kind. Yeah. Like Ellen. Ellen says, be kind to one another. And I'm on a mission to a million. I'm only 999,045 to go. Everybody, <laughs> tell your friends. Be fantastic. I just want to double check. I I did it right because I never... Oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think you did it right. Everybody, you like what you've seen, share, like, go to Mexico. That's it. That's it. No. Is it? What you, does it look like it? Um, uplifting interviews. If you're watching people do what John's doing, go to Uplifting Interviews with Total Strangers on YouTube. Hit subscribe. Hit the bell. Yeah, I'm, I'm already. You're subscribed. subscribed. Yeah. Sub, su, how do you say it in, in Spanish? Suscrito. Sus, he's suscrito. <laughs> yeah. <boy>. Great. <laughs> yeah, now, good. guys, this is the um, um, where the um, Golden Globes was the other night. Beverly Hilton and the Waldorf Astoria. Yeah. It's a. Uh, it's a few bucks to stay there. <laughs> um, let's go to the main. Santa Monica and Wilshire. Westwood's right over there. Beverly Hills is. We just passed Beverly Hills. Yeah, it's right here. Um, that's a great place to have a drink up on the top there. See, mm -hmm. the veranda uh, at the Waldorf. So you should go there for a drink. Um, then there's a Peninsula Hotel. I mean, lots of nice hotels yeah. here. You know, Century City is just off to the left. Well, actually, you're going to Century City right now. Right? Yeah. Everybody, thanks for watching. Viva la Mexico! Viva Mexico! Viva Mexico. <laughs> je, je, soy fantástico! Oh, soy fantástico! fantástico. <laughs> Muy bueno. Muy bueno. Hasta luego. Bye. Ciao, ciao. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye. Be fantastic.